just about basically life extension because if we really maintain the spine like you maintain your teeth, your spine protects your nervous system. And if your body has the capacity to better express nerve intelligence through the nervous system spinal cord by having better channels open because of proper spinal alignment, then you're going to have better expression of health. Well, and I fired 100 rounds or more handheld. And just for some reason, I'm always saying, oh, it doesn't kick. It made my spine just bow out. They wanted to do all this surgery. And I went to a chiropractor, and they fixed it in two visits, and this incredible pain was gone. But then I hear the mainstream media bashing chiropractors constantly. Oh, we've been vilified from the very beginning. I mean, there was a movie that was just out called Doctor, and I think that would be another great guest for you to have is Jeff Hayes. He just put the movie out, Bought, which is just about how the whole system's bought by Big Pharma and this whole vaccine push and... Uh, even the GMO push. You're 56 years old. I mean, you look like you're like 45. You, you could be 40. Simply amazing. I look at Dr. Joel Wallach and, and, you know, how healthy he is at his age. You know, finally he's 70 plus years old. Looks like he's 60. I want to get on this train. It takes a while to segue into it, my stressful life, but I'm doing it. But you, you, you cover sustainability. People saying, what's Alex Jones doing going to a conference that's partially about sustainability? Well, there's real environmentalists, real conservationists, that don't want nuclear reactors blowing up, that don't want to overfish, that don't want poison in our water, that don't want GMO. That's me versus the George Soros crowd that says the only problem is carbon dioxide, let's tax it. Right. I right. mean, you know, there's the real environmentalist who are the listeners of the show, and then there's the... I mean, I was talking to somebody about environmentalism at a restaurant. Somebody goes, you don't want to talk to him about trying to save the oceans. He doesn't care. He's Alex Jones. Like, there's this idea. It's just crazy. Right, right. I mean, who would want to hurt the planet for our children? That's the whole vision for me is I, I say this all the time. I have lived the most amazing life. My goal is to future generations to have that same opportunity. I mean, I look at my nieces and nephews, and I, I just really fear for what's going on. And the thing that scares me the most is this big bill they're trying to push in California, the SB 277, where it's going to be mandatory vaccination in California. We're going to talk about that. Uh, the Navy just came out with a Canadian government study and said that they vaccinated all these ships in the Canadian and U.S. Navy, and they had more flu. Well, of course. I mean, I, and personally, in my opinion, I, I really have zero faith in, in vaccines. I, I think they're hideously dangerous, and I, I really have zero faith in them. Mahatma Gandhi was against them. Of course. But the thing is... He reportedly I mean, had about 160 IQ. Right. Why are all these smart people concerned about them? Because they know the truth. And they haven't been snowed and, and brainwashed into believing that vaccines saved us from smallpox and polio and all the dogma that I always hear from people that typically have so much faith in something that they've been brainwashed by their media and by a pharmaceutical cartel, which controls the way the doctors think in the system. Well, I'm going to try to give you the floor for the, the next 40 minutes and about 20 minutes the next hour that I'm going to take calls. Uh, but what are some of the topics you want to get in today? Because I know you're an amazing speaker. I've seen a lot of the videos. People are, I mean, that's why your, your seminars are so popular, not just this big Cal Jam event. Well, they either love me or they hate me. They're probably kind of like you, right? Or does everybody love you? M most folks like me, but I think there's about 20% that hate my guts, yeah. Okay, well, that's probably my range as well. But I mean, who cares if... if oh, I know, I, it doesn't bother me. I have thick skin. We, I mean, after a while, you just get used to it. In fact, sometimes when I don't have enough haters, it's, I, I start to feel maybe I'm not pushing hard enough. Exactly. Do you ever use haters and people that lie about you and misrepresent what you say? Because that's what they always do. They build straw men. Right. Does that ever fuel you like you're tired? Oh, totally. And all of a sudden, you get attacked and you have all this energy? Right, I do. In fact, I, it's almost fun to me. But I think a lot of those... I think that's winners versus losers. Right, right. Winners don't mind losing sometimes because they're going to get better and win. It's when you're successful, people want to pull you down into their quagmire of just a lower vibration in life. And I, and I think people don't want you to be successful. And I don't get that. I see people that are successful by doing good, and I admire that. Right, and around right, them. right, right, right. But not everybody thinks the way you and I think. I think one of the biggest secrets of success in life is not being like that. I think these people feel bad about themselves, and so they can't imagine that somebody successful is, is good, so they have to demonize you because they have to think you got where you are through fraud. Right. Or luck, or whatever it is. But it's been hard work. I mean, I, I put a lot of time into this whole mission, and the goal is to get this to stadiums eventually. We're going to talk about your mission, your goal, your vision straight ahead. Stay with us. My name is Deb.
Bell, and I live in El Cajon, California. I was concerned about my cholesterol readings because I knew that high cholesterol is related to clogging of the arteries and increases the risk for heart attack and stroke. One day, I heard an ad for heart and body extract, and I was skeptical, but I decided to give it a try. Man, the numbers don't lie. Learn the secrets of an effective, natural, 100% organic nutritional supplement for a healthy heart and circulation at hbextract.com. Harvest Right, the makers of the only in-home freeze dryer would like to present to you their greenhouses that double as emergency shelters. Their greenhouses simply snap together, no tools needed. As a greenhouse, it will stand for decades. It's incredibly strong, long-lasting, and it can be quickly put up or taken down. It is also ideal when used as an emergency shelter. Learn more about this great greenhouse and the money you can save over the big box store prices at HarvestRight.com. That's HarvestRight.com. Hi folks, Alex Jones here with some important information. I want to tell you about Matt Redhawk and his team of patriots over at My Patriot Supply. Several years ago, Matt was sitting in his two-bedroom apartment, frustrated with the direction this country was headed, and the charlatans willing to sell us out for a quick buck. Deciding to take action, a company run by Patriots for Patriots was born. My Patriot Supply has never taken a loan or accepted outside funding. They now operate two distribution facilities and employ over 50 hardworking American men and women. It is rare to find companies who practice what they preach. And that's why I stock my pantry with high-quality storable foods from My Patriot Supply. Go to MyPatriotSupply.com forward slash Alex today for special offers on emergency food storage or call their preparedness specialist at 866-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. Do business with someone who shares your values. MyPatriotSupply.com slash Alex. What good is a Big Berkey water filter? We get that question a lot here at BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com. And in a word, the answer is protection. Protection from water main breaks, E. coli contamination, environmental chemical spills, pesticide runoff, chlorine taste and smell, and all forms of fluoride. Plus, Big Berkey water filters are the original gravity water filter system and most trusted on the market for a reason. Tested by multiple independent NSF EPA certified labs, they are the gold standard in water purification. At only 1.7 cents a gallon, a single set of filters can last for 5 to 10 years. That means big savings. Big Berkey, the one that's powerful enough to purify stagnant pond water. Get a Big Berkey today at BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com. GCN listeners receive 5% off all ceramic filter systems. Visit our website or call 1-877-99-BERKEY. That's 877-99-BERKEY. Big Berkey Water Filters, for the love of clean water. There's a man named Dr. Joel Wallach who is anything but your typical doctor, both a veterinarian and naturopathic physician. Doc asks, why does the United States spend more money on health care by far and still rank 50th in health and longevity worldwide? He believes that people should empower themselves with a basic understanding of nutrition, take charge of their health, and attain optimal health and longevity through nutrition, not by toxic prescription drugs that lead to side effects and more toxic prescription drugs. Doc Wallach's message is resonating with an increasing number of Americans who are waking up to all the big government, big pharma, and big insurance manipulation of our health care system. I'm George Dory, and I like what Doc Wallach is saying and doing to enlighten people about health care. Visit criticalhealthnews.com and listen to Dr. Wallach's Deadly Recipes Lecture. It makes a lot of sense, and I urge you to join our Critical Health News team. Go to criticalhealthnews.com. That's criticalhealthnews.com. Dr. Billy DeMoss of CalJam.org is our guest. If you go to Infowars.com forward slash CalJam or just follow any of the banners on Infowars.com or PrisonPlanet.com, uh, you can find select tickets that have been held back in the front section and then up in the top section. And I've seen these type of theaters. It doesn't matter where you're sitting. It's a beautiful theater. Uh, there are about one-third of the tickets left, and they just went on sale today to the general public. The other two-thirds are reserved to all the different uh, healthcare type folks, chiropractors, uh, nutritionists, and people that are going to be there. 
if you look at the incredible lineup of music and speakers, it's uh, mind-boggling. Uh, but you wanted to, instead of promoting Cal Jam, talk about your vision for Cal Jam, why you did it, and then the big fight in California, the bellwether, where they're trying to pass forced inoculation. I mean, as a kid, I grew up a big rock and roll fan. I mean, I, I grew up on Black Sabbath, Deep Purple, and there was this huge event out in Ontario called California Jam. And there would be literally this mass of people, 250,000 people, going to an event, and I just have always visualized if we could get people on the same plane of everything that you and I know and get them awakened and then empowered, then we can take that action to really make change in this world and go against the forces that are the global elite. My listeners are always saying, Alex, you, the key is to get music involved right. and right. comedy with political speech that's libertarian, anti-globalist, instead of it all being fake left-wing or right-wing. So that's basically your vision, and you're now doing it successfully. Well, you got to make it fun for people. I mean, if, if people come to the event, and it's like everybody there is a lover. They are Everybody's happy. But the, at the same time, we're all super serious about making change for this planet. And it, the only way we're going to, there's way more of us than there are of them. So if we can collectively get more and more people into our boat, we can really actually make, make a mission to change what's going on. And it's got to shake up the system because they want to make it left or right. You can't put a label on a group of people like this. They are just some of the most awake for the general public are the type. Why are chiropractors so awake? I mean, every chiropractor I know I, I, that I run to on the street or on trips is a listener and knows more than I do, basically. Well, chiropractors have been brought up with a philosophy of vitalism, and we've never really been into taking drugs. So I think the more people are drugged up, i.e. from the very beginning with the vaccines, and we'll talk about that in a little bit, I mean, it just then more and more drugs are put on people. And, I, and literally, I think over time, it just dumbs people down, and they're not as in tune with reality anymore. And they're so susceptible to believing everything that they see on TV. I mean, I don't watch any TV. I'll watch your show. But... Other than that, I mean, I don't even own a TV because I don't want to get that daily brainwashing that everybody else gets to believe in all this fear that they try to sell and the agenda that they're trying to push us down. More and more, it looks like the agenda is starting to fail. That's why they're trying to double down and really force all of this. I think all the forced inoculations and forced fluoride, right. I think it's blowing up in their face. Right. I mean, that's the whole thing with this SB 277 in California. They know, in fact, where I'm so from, scary. Orange County, California, supposedly has the highest unvaccinated rate of any county in the United States. And I'm, gonna, I'm not going to take credit for it, but I have really been for 25 years teaching people in my community the truth about vaccines. And I've also really promoted other chiropractors in our neighborhood to do the same thing, to get out and teach this stuff. Because once people hear the truth, it's hard to believe the lies anymore. And then I just really try to get people to read and do their own research rather than blindly believing all the the drivel that they hear on mainstream media and all the stuff that the their pediatricians spout out because the pediatricians have been brought up in a system that's controlled by pharma pharmacia sure and, and it's just the system's rigged. all i know is i could hardly walk and i went to the chiropractor on a monday and on a wednesday they did all these adjustments hooked up the electricity systems that you know relax the muscles and then did more x-rays and my spine was back 80% where it was supposed to be. Then I came back a third time, they popped it completely back, and I haven't been back. Right. Three visits, I said two, two got it where it was almost better. Three visits, completely better, x-ray, spine straight. I'd already gone to the medical doctor, and they wanted, They said, oh, you got to go have surgery. Oh, I mean, I hear uh, that all the time. I mean, that's, but I mean, miraculous. Right. So you have to be shut down. You're not a real doctor. Right, right, right. Just because I don't have an MD after my name. You just get such great results. Well, you know, until 80 years ago, there were four different types of doctors. You know, in the establishment. Now they only say MDs. Right. And, and, and the thing about Jeff Hayes that I was talking about, I, I think he'd be a great addition to one of your shows in the future. He did a movie called Doctor where the, actually the AMA came out with goals to contain and eliminate the chiropractic profession. I remember. I want to get him on. Yeah. yeah he would be great. And he's very articulate. And he's, he's got two great movies that are great for your viewers to see as well. Bought one of them. Well, all I know is... Um my uncle from a motorcycle accident was going to have to have surgery. He goes to a chiropractor once a month. He has his back pain's gone. I mean, I'm not here trying to sell chiropractic. It's just that they, they demonize it in the news all the time because it's such a good alternative. Right. But I want people to understand that you, you, we could take you to the next level of health by getting on a regular... Let's talk about that okay. when we come all back. Right, Stay with us. We're on the march. The Empire's on the run. Alex Jones and the GCN Radio Network. 
used since before the days of the Roman Empire to support the body's natural systems and enhance overall health. Introducing the new InfoWarsLife.com oil of oregano formulation.